But guys, just look at it. The left, so you can see how clean it is on the side. And then. Oh my god, it's so clean. The back is black. Did you see that girl? The girl standing she was like. Hi. She was like. She walked right behind me. Taiwan's Epic Energy Technology launched buses using its dual fuel system at the World Games in Kaohsiung last year. The technology, which enriches normal gasoline with oxyhydrogen gas to get a cleaner burn, has now won a prestigious International Energy Globe Award. This car's engine feeds off two kinds of fuel. One is gasoline, the other, amazingly, is water. It's RO water, regular normal portable water that is then poured directly into the combustion device. This dual fuel system for buses, autos and trucks won Epic Energy Technology the top Energy Globe award in the air category. It received the award during a ceremony in Rwanda in late June. The top three also included the United States and Sweden. We won the top global energy prize or presented the award at the ceremony by the Deputy Secretary General of the United Nations. Simply put, the device separates the water's hydrogen and oxygen through electrolysis and then the two gases burn to generate energy. The heat created can be used to cut or weld steel or heat your stove at home. Over a year ago, Gaussian City began using a dual fuel system in its city buses. The vehicles, which ran on diesel fuel, did not get complete burns, wasting fuel and generating high levels of carbon emissions. Adding the hybrid fuel system has made the buses far more environmentally friendly. Epic Energy Technology is also involved in developing solar cells. It hopes to eventually be able to use solar power for the electrolytic process that turns water into a fuel so it can take another step in its campaign
Tutupnya nggak diganti, Mas? 